Hi guys, welcome back to XCOM UFO Defense, hard mode expansion, starting episode 7. Get back in there. So it is the 9th of February, 9.30 in the morning. And just trying to recall what we did last time. It's been a bit of it's been about a week since I played. Um We've got a bit of cash here, 2.2 mil. That's great. And I think we're waiting for that laboratory to come online. And we're gonna stock up on a couple more scientists. Um Working on the new Sky Ranger to try to get our bottom line a little bit tighter. So right now we still monthly costs. We're still making money, which is good. And yeah, I don't want to overstretch, but so far this base has been very lucrative for us. It's been um, we've been harvesting supply ships, and I will just keep doing that because I, I have no mercy in that regard. Um, one thing I was wondering a little bit about was you know where would our third base be? And um, a lot of Russia, a lot of China. You know, Australia, those are all completely uncovered. Um, so what is China? Yeah, not a huge spender. France is big. We got France nice and covered. USA, we got covered. South Africa and Brazil. So, yeah, Brazil's big. Australia's big too. Hmm. So the couple big places. Um, you know, it might be good to... Yeah, if we do Brazil, we have to. We can't get over, you know, do South Africa as well. We may get South Africa kind of by via this space with a little more uh, when we get the hyper hyperwave decoder. If we get it, this might be the smart move: is putting a base like here and sort of tying off a big part of China, Japan. What's Japan? Uh, yeah, Japan's a big big player. So yeah, right about here maybe, and have overlapping fields, and then yeah, somewhere in there. And uh, yeah, so anyway, that's getting ahead of ourselves though. We gotta finish off this base first. And um, let me just check the Sky Ranger to see what the situation is. 13 people on board, great, we're ready to go. Guess we've got all the kit we need. Hopefully I dealt with that last time. Um, got the pistols, that's good. Alloy pistols are turning out to be cool. And rocket launcher, four rockets, yeah, that's good. Okay, so it all, all looks good. Um, and yeah, let's accelerate time, guys, and find out what happens here. Okay, alloy shotgun shells. So I was making those. What else? Uh, sniper alloy. So one thing that's sort of around the corner. Let's make a couple more. Okay, let's just... Uh, I, I, let's just quickly check. Sorry, because I don't actually know what we have, but... Pistol. Um, pistol alloy. Whoa, 53. That's a lot. Okay, that was a little unnecessary. Shotgun and sniper. So we, we should make some more sniper. To round it out. Um, sniper alloy rounds. Make another 20. So the pistol was a times three, I think, so that's why. Okay. Probably sell a few of those, but. And sell, like, and it's just for store space. Let's sell it down to 30. Am I gonna regret that? It's for 6,000 bucks. Okay. Well, let's try to burn through it. If we run into space problems, we'll sell it. And yeah, we're doing the alloy clips. That's good. Soldiers, we got a couple extra a couple of wounded and a couple looks like we bought a couple handful okay a bunch of extra stuff coming taser pistols nice sniper rifle good um already it's a good check so let's keep going all that stuff arrived okay let's go quickly check to see what the sky ranger situation was was i short on grenades no um there's the taser stuff. I don't think we need to bring that yet, but I guess we might as well throw a couple on board. Um, it's three and three. Okay. So yeah, I mean, taking the base is definitely on the radar is something we need to do. Um, it's worth a lot of money, worth a lot of points. So one thing I'm thinking though is that like, Again, the placement of this this base, I, I think it could be affecting... Maybe it's affecting China. Yeah, if... Uh, is that part of Egypt? So these are the countries, right? Russia, China, India, Egypt. What is that part of? Like, you know what I'm saying? It's bizarre. I don't actually know... Wait, is that part of... Yeah, like these are the these are the funding boundaries, right? So what what's not accounted for here? India, China, you know, 
Oh, okay. Germany and France, Italy. Yeah, I know. Spain is all the way over there. It's not Egypt. It Maybe it's part of... It's not part of Nor North Africa, is it? There's not, there is no North Africa. It's just Nigeria. It's an odd future, frankly. Past future. But anyway, my thought is that maybe that base... I guess we'll see who's unhappy with us. The States was unhappy with us before because that terror site. But nobody seems bothered by that base. So I'll just go with it. And this, we don't have... Um, I don't know. You know what I'm a little tempted to do is to do a couple of heavy cannon rounds. Because... I, actually... Just make six. Because, going back to the Ophopedia, the um, XCOM weapons, we go to the HP alloy rounds. These are 66. So, versus the sniper rifle, they're one of the stronger punch weapons that we have. 66 for armor piercing. So when we run into mutons, which is right around the corner, that could actually be useful for us. Try to take them out. And then the alien grenade. Um, the high explosive is obviously really strong. Where's the alien grenade? Oh, we haven't even researched it yet. So yeah, got to get the alien grenade too. But I, in my in the past, I always found that the uh, mutons were pretty resistant to explosive damage. So there's almost no point. But and maybe we um, deploy the sky ranger anyway, just in case we can get it. Oh, here we go. Probably gonna destroy it if we can. This thing's just worth a few points. It's, just, it's, it's it's better to recover it, but but um, they're rare to kind of you know almost never shoot them down, and uh, you know they land and they're likely to fly away. So it is better just to waste it if you can. Okay, that's done. So you know I don't want to get too crazy here, but I guess you know let's make a few more shotgun shells, just a few more, another ten. So we have. You know, we can end up shipping those to different bases and stuff when the time comes. Oh, here it is, guys. So, improved sky, the Sky Striker. A standard Sky Ranger which was refitted with an alien alloys airframe and additional engines, allowing us to transport more troops faster to ground combat. That's great. Um, cool, guys. That's amazing. Oh, let's, let's research this interceptor. Let's get it done. There's also the alloy cannon, which is a little interesting. Can we do it? No free hangers. So that's where we get into trouble here. This thing, 13 days, you know? How close is the end of the month? It's halfway. I've already paid for the Sky Ranger for this thing for the whole month. Huh. That's a tough one. Um, I don't want to sell it. I want to ship it. But this thing, this thing's ready at the end of the month. And it doesn't have general stores, so we can't ship the... Uh, the guns. Or maybe, maybe you can just fly the craft over with what's on it. You just can't unload it, but I won't be able to put ammo. Hmm. The general store is just like a 10 day build, I think. Uh, 10 days, yeah. So, could be okay. It'd be a place just to stash this thing uh, while we built the, the new Sky Ranger. Sky Striker. Hmm. I think we're gonna do that. It's a nice thing, you know, the extra store, the extra people is, is the big deal. So having like an extra few people on your mission, that's, that's a major deal. Okay, another very small, so they're doing some uh, recon missions on us. Trying to set up for something big. But we're wiping them out, which is good. I should check on the avalanche supply. What do we have for avalanche? Um, avalanche missile is 10. No, let's buy a few of those. Maybe I should be making, like when this finishes, maybe I should be making a, oh, I can't make the alloy cannon yet. Can I? I thought I saw it somewhere. Did I see it? Uh, uh, craft an armament. No. Okay. We have to research it. That's what it was. It was in the research tree as available. So yeah, um, it's really a shame we can't build that yet, but okay. One day till then. So the only thing is that. Do we want to wait to the end of the month to buy the scientists? We get a full month's worth of, you know, work out of them. Um, wait to the beginning of the month. Mm -hmm. I'd say maybe. Well, they take about three days to deliver. So that would take us, it's like a 10 days. It's we're wasting 20 days of scientists. It's a lot of money down the tubes. 
since money is so important, I'm going to say we maybe hold off for now. Okay, so I'm a little sensitive that we had that built early, but working on the workshop, which might have been unnecessary as well. Check the store space. Stores are almost full again, guys. I, oh, we'll get another one coming. Yeah, that's good. So yeah, I'm going to hold off. I want to save these four. We need alien containment. We need... Um, we need the psionic training facility. We need a hyperwave decoder, which I guess I may put down here. Ah, I don't know. So yeah, maybe this is about it. Like we're getting close to maxing this base out, unfortunately. If I want to maintain the tight defensive structure, which, you know, I do. Let's take a look at the graphs again and see what, what's happening in the world. So North America is flat. That's good. Arctic, Antarctica, nope. South America, Europe. We know about Europe. North Pacific and South Pacific. Those dropped off. That might have been the uh, terror mission. Indian Ocean's creeping up. Um, where's the Indian Ocean? Over here? Hmm. Okay, I don't know what to make of that. Nothing spiked, so I don't think there's another base just yet. But it's not good just to be passing time like this. Okay, Black Sea, General Stores. Yeah, that's good. Well, you know, it's nice to have. But that's about it, guys. Yeah, we're going to wait. Now, missile defenses are a waste of space. I'm not sure what this mod, if you can upgrade them, that would be really cool if you could upgrade them to um, the later defensive structures, which can be really good. Because inevitably they find out where this base is and they start to hammer it with attacks. Although I believe that, okay, here we go, here we go. This is it guys, attack, go, come on. Actually, can we get it landed even better? Ah, let's shoot it down, I guess. Going aggressively. There it is. Little one. Let's go get it. Okay, and let's hold in patrol for just a sec so we don't go. I want to go in proper daylight. Okay. Oh, guys, here we go. So, F Fikret Ural, you are first out. First out of the uh, Sky Ranger here. Shotguns. Smokes, not bringing that, but I will give you proximity. This, might as well give you a... Now, something that somebody else mentioned, uh, I think, was it Dominic? I can't remember, sorry. Is that um, it's good to have them a little bit overweight so that they, they train up. Just a little bit overweight. Now, yeah. But he's actually got a good accuracy, this guy. Um... But yeah, not too overweight. Uh, just a little bit overweight. Let's leave him for now because he's the first out. I don't want him just to like, you know, horrifically die because he was overweight. But the other guys, okay, so Demetrius, you're new. You have really low accuracy. You're definitely not using this. You're a shotgun. I want to say shotgun bait, but you're shotgun material. Um, and I will give you a stun gun, I guess. Just, just oh, uh, you know what? Sorry, I'll give you a pistol. So you're a little bit overweight. Ah, uh, you're a rookie. Let's give you. Let's let you break in with full, full um, spec, and then we'll tire you out next mission. Um, okay, so you're gonna have. So we gotta refit a bunch of rookies here. Um, gee, he's pretty accurate and a pretty good reaction. But anyway, rookie. We'll just see who else we have. I can't remember who else we have in the craft. So just load him down a little bit. We'll put him slightly over. That's good. One point over, I think, is good. Um, yeah, another shotgun bait. Um, he's carrying that heavy, heavy thing. But that's okay. Let's put him a little bit over again. Just a touch. These guys are further back in the craft. I'm less concerned about them. This guy's just pure shotgun bait. Put him a little over so he gains some strength. Okay, so this guy's way in the back. Yeah, Grenadier, good situation. But let's again, let's put him over a bit so he's heavy, so he gains. Um, good advice on that, by the way. Jalila, she was really good last mission, um, but she's not very accurate. She's got good reactions. You know what, with a shotgun though, not being accurate is actually a good thing. You spray around. Tell you what, let's give her a pistol. Yeah, let's put this on her leg, give her a pistol. 34, let's drop, 
cup of smoke. Yeah, you're gonna be a little heavy, Jalila, but I'm training you up. Albina, back in action. Let's give you um, a bit more. Oh, I'm sorry, we're gonna give you a pistol. These these guys, Grenadiers need pistols for sure. That's why we have them. 43, a little heavy. Drop the proximity there, that's good. And you, Jacob. You're looking pretty good. Let's put you a little bit over once again. I'll give you this, just your touch over to start with. Rahul, how is Rahul still alive? Accuracy 70, Rahul is born again, the sniper. And um, it's crazy that his accuracy has gone up so much. It's really mind blowing, but yeah, he's good to go. So let's get him in like that. Lip tack, good old lip tacks. He's really a dead eye sniper now. And again, we'll put him just a touch over. He should have a pistol anyway. That's really over. Pull back on the grenades and stuff. There we go. Just a little bit over. Najib. Um, yeah, forward shotgun man with uh, a bunch of good stuff here. Give him a smoke so he's at one point over. And Fickrel. Okay, we're back to the beginning. So, wait. We had two snipers, one heavy, and two grenadiers. Yeah, I like it. Make kits are sort of a few make kits in the back. This guy, he needs to carry, I might as well carry an extra smoke. Hack two extra smokes. Although I suppose I could just give him a pistol, right? Oh, we're out of pistols. Yeah, I should definitely load some more of those now that I look at it. Okay, we'll keep them. There's no point in stunning anybody right now. Pickles in the middle. Okay, let's do this. Okay, good, good, uh, a pretty good placement to start. Let's do the old drop the smoke where we stand kind of thing. Just because we're, we don't want to take any chances. Demetrius, you might as well prime one actually. And then we'll wait this out. Okay, drone scout, down you go. Oh, and it's the reveal. Floaters, floating. Whoa. Okay, I'm. Let's do this, cause that guy's, that guy's getting a reaction shot for sure. Um, okay, Fickrel, you're in. Like this is you, rookie time. Oh, here we go. That looked good. Do one more. No. Not gonna do it. Pull you back. I'm gonna recycle some rookies here. Albin. I even even see Albin's name in the, the beginning, but that's okay. Oh. Okay, pull Albin back. I'm a little reluctant to get too many people out, but we gotta drop some of these guys. Like, it's the way it is. That guy can smoke. More rookies here? Yeah, Gabriel. Oh, why did I do that? I blew that completely. Gabriel, come on. Do this for us. Oh, come on, really? Gonna get in trouble here. Okay, I'm gonna get Demetrius down. I'm going to extend this smoke screen. And take a shot. He can kneel and take a shot. And drop the guy. The other guy is still a real hazard, I would say. But I am reluctant to, to overextend too much because we're grenade bait. Let's try... Uh, it's grenade bait. Let's hold back. We're about to lose a whole bunch of rookies to a grenade. So let's just save some people. Everybody lip hack. Yeah, so this is gonna be ugly guys. That's that's the biggest grenade bait I've ever seen. Really? I could pull the drone scout forward as a as a um decoy. That grenade that smoke grenade is probably gonna help a bit. Mm, I think I'm actually gonna do it. Oh sectoid. Oh now I regret that. That was dumb. Oh, okay, Demetrius, you're on point. Okay, let's just, let's kill this thing. You guys are a shotgun squad. Oh, thought she just hit Demetrius in the back. Okay. Pickerel, let's do this. Somebody's got to drop the sectoid too. That looked good. Where's the sectoid? Drop my, uh, there it is. Oh, sneaky sectoid. Okay, Alan, this one's, oh, he can't shoot, shoot through Demetrius. Okay, Demetrius is pulling back. You are dropping to a knee, Alvin, and let's get, do a little practice here. Oh, yes, in the face. Shredded it a bit. I'm gonna pull more rookies in and put more lead down. 
Buckshot, I guess. Alloy Buckshot. I don't know what that is. 40%. Let's do this. No. Okay. Oh, I blew that completely. Okay, well, who else? We gotta get the snipers out. We're gonna deploy the snipers. Um, I'm not gonna pull too many people back. I can't believe I, I just threw that thing away. I could've just trusted my smoke, but I got nervous. Okay, what's the line of fire there? He's gonna hit landing gear, but... I don't know. I'm real... Mm. It's a death pit here, you know? Let's pull... Nah, no. Yeah, okay. So, can this be done? 28? 22. I think it can be done. Oh my god. Oh no. Oh my gosh. And yourself, Anastasia. Anastasio. Oh no. Well, hey, you thinned it out a bit for more shotgun people to get out, but... Right? At least I don't have to worry about an alien grenade killing everybody now. There's that to think about. Jalila, you can do this. Come on. Oh, Jalila, I'm going to sacrifice Jalila too. This is turning into a disaster, guys. Okay, let's pull these guys out. So We need, we need fire support now. This is I've done this so badly. This is turning into a complete disaster. Unnecessary. Oh, Jacob, no. No. Twenty-four. This is turning really, really ugly, guys. Really ugly. We're about to lose the whole squad. Who's got a smoke? You do. Rahul, you'll never be able to take a shot anyway. Let's let's do this. Okay, give a little extra smoke to those guys so that they have some chance. And we're not pulling these guys out of the craft because they're gonna everybody's about to die. I'm sorry, uh Liptak, you know, that was careless. This is turning into a complete nightmare. We're gonna have to bail. Squad wipe. To a small too. Oh she went berserk. Okay. Okay, let's drop this thing. Okay, lip tack, you do this. 104%. Alloy round. Right through the chest. Okay. And actually unfortunately lip tack has is a medic. I gotta check my medics. Who's a medic? Lip tack, of course, that was dumb. Najib, you're a medic. Okay, great. That's perfect. So who's wounded? You're wounded and you're going to die. You're wounded. You have eight points left. Let's get you back up onto the craft. Okay. Rahul's got to come out for Overwatch. Um, what's this going to be? Oh, he might be able to do this. He can kneel. And he can do... Oh, I threw that away. Yeah, Rahul. We know why you pay. We pay you the big bucks. That's good. Um, okay, so you're coming back up to get healed right now. Because this is disaster. Put you here. Najib, break it out. You're gonna burn a whole kit probably on this this lady. Oh no, just the one. Okay. But she's out of action. Who else is damaged? She's damaged. She's gotta get healed. Berserk is a bad place to be. Um because she's got what's she carrying? Oh, she doesn't have any ammo in at least. That's the one one good piece piece of good news there. Okay, Jalila, you're holding back. Demetrius, you're holding back. I'm gonna wait a turn on this. Okay, you're pulling up to here. Lip tack, you're done for the turn. Anastasia, you are ever done. You're done. I might have to fire her just because of this. Like the my own my own bad though. I shot straight into the back engine of the plane. You know. Whoops. Oh, this is the wounded person. Yeah. Okay. We got to get her out of the smoke at some point. What happened to the, uh... Oh yeah, he's down there, okay. So here goes, guys. Here goes. <laughs> Jalila. You bastards. Lip tack's gonna step in on this, too. They took Jalila from us, guys. Whoa, we took it. Tried Jacob uh, Zabo. 
threw it away. Who's next? Okay, it's shotgun time. She needs healing, but we got some problems here. I don't have that many people that can shoot anymore. Like, we're kind of like, we're thin, guys. This guy, Demetrius, aim shots. Ah, the beating this thing's taking. Oh, rookie, um, could get out and take a few shots. Let's do it. Neil, you know, she's not gonna do us any good in the craft. She's not gonna do us any good out here either. Oh, it's coming down to it. This is the one. That's the one that got Jalila, I think. Okay, heal her up. And give her a painkiller too, so she doesn't panic anymore. Okay, that's better. Let's pull her back to here. She's still gonna be in the action. Even though she's... I'm gonna load her up again. Although she gets mind controlled, it's over. For everybody. In a terrible, violent way. I mean, in fact, when mind control happens, it's just... Game over, man. Game over. Oh! Did I, like, forget about this guy? Well, he was right in there. He was in us. Okay, we need another sniper up here. I've got to hope for the best on this, guy. Here we go. Not having our scout is... Okay, she passed out from smoke inhalation. She's not injured. So there's still somebody in the craft, believe it or not. Look at the spottings. Look at these guys. Lip tack. Step in. Drop. That guy had a heavy plasma, too. He meant business. Okay, pull up. Pull back. Oh, don't reserve any time for snapshots. Just go. Okay, this guy, Demetrius, I don't know, you know, it's like we're pulling... We almost, like, you know, we almost don't have enough squad to do this anymore. Like, we've shed so many people unnecessarily. We have no, very few, like, rookies to take the place, you know? Oh, it's stressful is what it is, but... Okay, it's going to be like lip and people going in. Anastasia, you know, she's going in. Well, let's see if we can't do like a little more thinning out here. Yeah, there's nobody like we're down half our squad's dead. Sounds like people are indoors. Okay, there's the craft. It looks like it's pretty chewed up. Let's, the rookies are on recon, of course, right? Yeah, we can see the craft. It looks like the door's blown out. We got floaters, so they could be popping out all over the place. It's a small. Tell you what. Let's help this guy out with a bit of smoke. Abina, can you do this for us? That's right. Are you kneeling? You should be kneeling. This guy. Okay, Najib's Najib's a you know, he's a hard hard person. Let's um get him ready to help the assault. Okay, we know that we're pretty good for um yeah, that's probably clear. So let's move the heavies down this way to engage directly on the thing. Lip tack, I'm going to keep there. Okay, indirect fire support's good. No, we've got one sniper here. Okay, let's leave that for now, actually. That's a pretty good cover. But we'll move up into that smoke with a rookie. That's not a lot of smoke. Tell you what, this rookie is going to be up here just to completely cover that side. And then this guy, Demetrius. You're moving up to the smoke. And now we're going to pull this sniper down here, Rahul. I can't believe Rahul became a sniper. That's amazing. Zabo's coming down to here. Now, we don't fully know about this corner. That's something to think about. Uriel is up. And he's going to take... He's got nine rounds left. Take his grenade back. Might as well take his ammo, I guess. And he's going to be going into the craft, so we want to get him online. He's injured, but we're going to get our money's worth out of him. He's going to be um, incapacitated for a week or two. We might as well, you know, get some action out of him. Lip tack. Okay, lip tack. I'm going to pull you. Oh, we have a sniper down there, so let's put a sniper up here. Hope for the best on this. Here we are. Okay, might as well kneel. So the, the craft is wide open, so we might end up seeing something soon. Okay, so you're going to go around back.
pull into there. Good spotting, sp spotting place. And then I guess we were forced to push down with Zabo. I, I should do more smoke too. What is that? Oh, that's the dead damage drone scout. Nice. We'll repair that out. Who's got smoke? We're kind of short on smoke, guys. Here we go. It's this guy who's going to be seriously impaired. Yeah, throwing accuracy. No, he's down. They can't do it, really. Um, I guess he could do the old um, switcheroo. What about you, Najib? Najib can do it for us, right? Um, can't throw there. 25. Really? Okay, you got to stand up and do it. Here. Thank you. We're going to make contact really soon. Oh, that keeps passing out. Okay, Zabo. This is not good. I guess he's probably safe to here, but... Okay, that's a clear corner. That's good. Um, okay, she's got to move in. She's not not great for movement points, let me tell you. She's going to charge in and spot. We need we need support now. Okay, it's time to converge on the place. Move up blip tack. Move up uh, this guy. We're going to just push up one step at a time here, guys. Um... A raggedy squad that we have. Abina. Move up. Everybody move up. Okay, grenade bait there. Let's just, you know, we're going to use the smoke and hope for the best on it. Okay, Rahul. Um, push you up a little bit. That's it, guys. That's like the whole squad. Ariel's going to get up soon. We lost four people there. In that bloodbath. So the problem is here, she's going to spot somebody and be unable to do anything about it. She's going to go around back, actually. Right? So we better we better do the same thing with everybody. Is Yeah. Push up here. This is how we're going to engage the craft, is by flanking it. Lip tack's going in. And he's going to use his pistol. Um, put the rifle away. Anastasia is going to have to use her pistol, too. Put this thing away for now. Uh, okay, you can do that. Go. Albina. You're a bit dangerous with that, aren't you? Okay, let's... I'm gonna leave you... I'm just afraid she's gonna shoot. Let's get up to here. I really like Albina. I don't want her to die, but... Could happen. Okay, Zabo, you're on recon here. He's kind of... Yeah, so he's shooting right up the, the thing. And then we'll get the sniper as well, back up. Although... The, the grass tends to block snipers. I think the sniper might want to be back here. Let's just hope for the best. And yeah, Kiriel's not up yet. These guys are flanking. Okay, that's and this guy's on Overwatch. In fact, Demetrius, I'm gonna stand you up so you can get a shot off. No idea what his reactions are, but okay, let's carefully go around the corner here. Okay, it's clear. Does she have reactions? She has very decent reactions, so we'll keep her on. Overwatch. Somebody's in the craft, you know, just going back and forth. Lip tack. Put away your sniper rifle. Gee. I guess, you know, just drop it. You know, it seems crazy, but... Okay, I, I, uh, I guess you're going to be there. And Anastasio. I know she didn't, you know, it's like she, I gave her the order to shoot. It's not. It's not her fault. It's my fault. I did that. Okay, we're gonna need more backup in the craft for sure. I could just shell the craft, you know, but um, kind of rather. Oh, spotted. Shucks, I've moved everybody already. Oh, this is bad. I can't shoot through him. Oh, this whole team's moved already, and she's gonna come out and engage them. It's gonna come down to him taking a, a snap. That felt good. Okay, I'm gonna keep the sniper here. Demetrius went down. He came out the top, guys. And I don't longer have a sniper rifle armed, so... Alloy. Wow, Demetrius, you know, I'm sorry, man. I did like you, but... You know, you're taking a dirt nap. Let's push up. This is it, guys. Converge. 
Leave lip tuck on Overwatch. Now I wish he had his his rifle. This is the thing, you know. You, but this this squad. Ah, uh, uh, we might just need it. If she shoots though. She blows everybody up. Let's put it away and hope for the best with the. That might be everybody too. Let's hope that was the last guy. Okay, Rahul. Uh, tell you what. Yeah, let's bring you back out online so you can both engage. And you're both just gonna sit there and, and hope for the best. Let's do this. That's it. Oh, what a bloodbath, guys. For a small, you know? So there was only 10 of them total. Nine we killed. Oh my gosh. And they took out five of us. Out of a squad of 13, you know? So that's a two to one. Not even quite two to one. For like some petty stuff, you know? On the bright side, most of the core members survived. I mean, Jalila, gosh, you know, I won't forget her, but I think there's a memorial somewhere, isn't there? Oh, soldiers, memorial. Jalila, there she was, 23rd of Feb. Two missions and six kills. She was the one that got off that special. Yeah, so cool that you can look at all this performance. Oh, so cool. She got the heroic order. Oh, posthumous, yeah. So she killed seven floaters? Really? Jalila? It says only six here. I don't know how that, so it doesn't add up. Anyway. This is cool, all this stuff. I've never seen this before. Night missions. Wow. Three friendly fire incidents. That was this last mission. Oh my god. Uh cool guys. Very cool. So anyway, we got issues. Let's try to let's try to load this thing back up. Um Oh no, we're back up to 13 and the Colonel and everybody, we got a lot of heavies that are kind of in the wings. So that's good. Um, and we could load up the drone scout. That's good. Let's get our manufacturers on repair. Oh, we can't repair it, can we? Yeah, we can. Nice, go do it. 125K, it's a lot, you know? Um, but that's good. I mean, I'd like to say it saved us lives. I don't think it did, but let's do our cell. Plasma blade, plasma pistol, get rid of those. I really, I'm never going to use these. Dump them. Um, plasma rifle. Plasma shotgun, yep. Keeping the Illyrium rounds is our strategy for now, for some reason. Not that I know what they're good for, but... I'm um, keeping the launchers because we're on our way to um, containment. Alien grenade, Illyrium. Okay, mine probe, floater corpses, you know, sectoid. Okay, there it is, guys. So, 700k. You know, and we're gonna have to buy. Let's buy five more soldiers. So yeah, we netted 400k on that. I'm gonna say it wasn't a complete loss. One thing I will do is put a couple more pistols. We have six. Oh. Okay. Since everybody's shotgun, though, let's put eight. They're good. I like them. Ooh, and this. Yeah, let's definitely put a couple of these in. Every heavy cannon guy should have this. In fact, I'm a, I'm a little tempted to start getting some heavy cannon snipers going. You know. There's two heavy cannons, four of those, and four HE. That should be a good loadout. And incendiary, I don't quite know why I'm taking it, but so be it. Two snipers, six per, that sounds about right. Uh, I guess it should be 18 shotguns if everybody used to have two. And yeah, it's looking pretty good. It's looking like a pretty good loadout. And we've given up on armor, I think, is, is our strategy. We're not, we're not investing in armor. Um, because I haven't yet done armor repair. Oh, that's amazing. So five days until that. So yeah, hopefully next next mission, guys, we um we get that all sorted out with the base in uh, North America. So anyway, guys, let's cut it there. Thanks so much for watching. It's been a big pleasure. I'll catch you next time.